Now we're in the, the garage parking pad area of my home. And between, between my home and my neighbors, we've got these emerald green arborvitas that give us a little bit of privacy. Both of our garages face each other. And this is a really narrow growing arborvita that requires no pruning. It's very hardy, great plant. And in front of it, we've got these limelight uh, hydrangeas that just add that, that pop of color against our evergreen backdrop. Like this, this emerald uh, green arborvitas, like the green wall, and then we have our you know, uh, beautiful white limelight hydrangeas in front of it. And I'm gonna spin the camera around a little bit. And over here, we've got the entrance to, to the backyard. And we've kind of denoted that entrance with this arbor. This is an Atlas Cedar uh, trained tree growing in an arbor. It's a really, really beautiful tree. And then over here, we've got, we've got a Vitex tree. And these, these bloom beautifully. It looks, some people get them confused with butterfly bushes. But that's, it's a really beautiful, it's real similar in, in shape to a crepe myrtle. And then over here, let me move this back just a little bit. We've got our garage, and this is, uh, you can see, this, this is another arborvita that, that's a topiary, and we actually cut out the concrete and placed it in between these two garages. And then we've got this new dawn climbing rose that we've been, we've been training. You can see it started over here, and we've almost, it's almost starting to touch right there in the center. And it's got the same thing on this other side over here. It's going all the way up over the garage. It's taken a couple years to do that, but it's really pretty. And then you've got, you've got our, this is our, our, our columns right here. And then when we installed these columns, I left about a three or four inch space. And that's where we planted these, these horsetail reed. And it just adds, a, it just softens that wall. And these can be kind of sort of invasive, but the way we design this is so that, that they, they have nowhere to go. So that just, that totally softens that wall. And then you've got, um, we installed these copper lanterns. You know, we do a lot of lighting. We do a lot of with, with copper fixtures like this. And they just, they just really set it off, especially at night. It's got that nice warm glow that just feels like you're coming down to an entrance. So we'll go check out the front yard next.